the diagonals of trapezoids. We've been talking about trapezoids for the last couple of videos, and I've got some drawn on the board here. This one is a regular trapezoid that has legs that are two different lengths, because this angle is 65 degrees and this one's 70. This one is an isosceles trapezoid because this leg is the same length as this leg. The diagonals are drawn across from one corner to the other. On an isosceles trapezoid, the diagonals are congruent. That's our theorem. The diagonals of an isosceles tra trapezoid are congruent. It means they're the same length in an isosceles trapezoid, not one with two different leg lengths, not this one. The diagonals are not the same length because the legs are different lengths, okay? It's only for an isosceles one. So, the diagonal number one is green and diagonal number two is blue. And you can see that the diagonals are congruent. They're the same length as each other and they make congruent vertical angles. Angle one and angle three are congruent to each other and two and four are congruent to each other. Do you see that? So. That is how you draw the diagonals for a trapezoid. For an isosceles, it's this way, and for a regular one, it's that way. Our next video is going to be about finding the area in trapezoids. I'll see you there.